First of all, you must have Spartan version 16 or later. Airware versions are not suitable for use with OneDrive. OneDrive is not reliable. When you put your Quip data in the OneDrive folder, your data is at risk. Always keep at least one backup of your data somewhere else. To get started, go to Backup and Restore on the Tools menu. Click the Select Folder button and navigate to your OneDrive folder. That's your Windows Drive, usually C, slash Users, slash your username, slash OneDrive. Now click the Backup to this folder button. The reason for using backup to the OneDrive folder, rather than just moving your data there, is that you've left a copy in the original folder. You can now go to the Backup and Restore dialog again, click the Recent Folders button and reselect your OneDrive folder. This time, click the Use this folder for data button. You can continue to use Spartan on this computer while your data uploads to the cloud, but you should not attempt to use any other computer synchronised to the cloud until after this data is fully uploaded. Check the upload progress by hovering your mouse over the OneDrive icon. If you have many clips, the upload could take a considerable length of time. Before you synchronise another computer, Wait until the OneDrive folder on that computer is fully up to date. If you want to do it before the OneDrive folder is up to date, you can, but first, right click on the icon and open your OneDrive folder. Open the Clip Data folder and check that the files cpcolor.dat and groups.dat have been downloaded. If you switch this computer to the OneDrive folder before these files have been downloaded, you will lose your sheet names and sheet colours. As long as these two files are present, it's safe to switch. All your other data will appear as and when it downloads from the cloud. To link Spartan on other computers with the cloud data, go to Backup and Restore and click the Select Folder button. Navigate to the OneDrive folder on this computer and click the Use this folder for data button. If the data has not yet been downloaded from the cloud, wait 10 seconds and Spartan will start checking for changes. Each Spartan Quip has two files. One contains the Quip data, the other contains the Quip title and the thumbnail for the preview window. OneDrive downloads files in no particular order. Wherever one file for a Quip arrives before the other, Spartan shows missing file in the Quip title. These will clear as the other files arrive. To use the computer for other tasks while Spartan updates, go to the Tools menu and select Options OneDrive. Select the Continuous option for refreshing and close the dialog. When all your clips are synchronised, cancel the continuous refreshing. Once your data is in the OneDrive folder, you have a new option on the Tools menu. As you move the mouse over the options in this dialog, you will see a description of them in the Help area. Use the Pause button if you wish to read them now. A 
quick word about this option. It is not possible to cut or copy clips on two computers at the same time. If you try, one will always overwrite the other and you may also get missing files in other areas of the yellow section. If you need to use two computers at once, select this option and Spartan will keep your yellow area clips locally, avoiding conflicts. To summarise, automatic, 10 seconds and everything are the regular settings. You can use these at any time. Change to continuous if you are waiting for a clip to come through from another computer. If you know that this computer's OneDrive folder is up to date, and you know that Spartan is not being used linked to your cloud folder on any other computer, you can select off. Spartan will stop checking for changes, saving you lots of processing time. The changes you make on this computer will still be uploaded to the cloud. Change to 30 seconds if you find Spartan's menus disappear while you are making choices and change to this setting if two or more people are using Spartan at the same time. Turn OneDrive off if you are about to make major rearrangements to your clips and turn it back on when you are finished. Troubleshooting if your Spartan data disappears, right click on the OneDrive icon and click on Settings. Click the Choose Folders button and make sure the Clip Data folder is checked. Unless you have decided to stop using synchronized data, never uncheck this option. If you do, not only will it stop synchronizing, but it will delete all the files in the folder. If Spartan is running, it will crash, and when you recheck it, all your files will have to be downloaded again, duplicating the problem of starting Spartan before Group Start and CP Color Dat have been downloaded. If you want to stop OneDrive synchronizing without this hassle, just turn it off. Duplicates. You may occasionally see notices from OneDrive saying that it has duplicated Spartan files. You can ignore these. Spartan does a cleanup after each update. If you do lose your sheet names, go to your backup, copy the files as CP Color Dat and Groups Dat. Paste them to the Clips Data folder in your OneDrive folder. You cannot have too many backups of your data. If you are working with OneDrive, you can do this very easily by selecting Original Folder and then clicking Backup to this folder. If you do this on one computer, you have one backup. If you do it on the second computer, you have two backups. If you ever lose your data on OneDrive, go to Backup and Restore on the Tools menu, click the Original Folder button, then click Restore from this folder. Don't forget that after a restore, all your files have to upload to the cloud on this computer and have to download to other computers. In order to work with OneDrive, the Spartan program must contain details of OneDrive's file name, its location, its command line switches, and most of all, its duplicate file naming rules. These items were programmed in January 2017 using OneDrive version 17.3. Should Microsoft change any of these items in future releases of OneDrive, there is no guarantee that Spartan will still work with it.